Here are the different activity sheets that can be used for home studying in this grade 8 mathematics. This is the first quarter. So activity number one, it is finding common monomial factor. Activity number two, it is about factoring the difference of two squares. Activity number three, factoring sum and difference of cubes. Activity number four, it is factoring perfect square trinomials. Activity number five, factoring trinomial whose leading coefficient is one. Activity number six, factoring general quadratic trinomials. Activity number seven, solving geometrical problems using factoring. Activity number eight, solving number problems involving quadratic equations. Activity number nine, classifying rational algebraic expressions from non-rational. Activity number 10, simplifying rational algebraic expression. Activity number 11, adding and subtracting similar rational algebraic expression. Activity number 12, adding and subtracting the similar rational algebraic expression. Activity number 13, Multiplying rational algebraic expression. Activity number 14. Dividing rational algebraic expression. Activity number 15. Solving motion problems involving rational expression. Activity number 16. Solving work problems involving rational expression. Activity number 17, describing the rectangular coordinate system and its use. Activity number 18, illustrating linear equations into variables. Activity number 19, illustrating the slope of a line. Activity number 20, Identifying the slope of a line representing by the Activity number 21 Rewriting the standard form of linear function into slope intercept form Activity number 22 Graphing linear equation using two points Activity number 23 Graphing linear equation using slope and one point activity number 24 trend of the graph of linear equation activity number 25 determining linear equation given any two points activity number 26 finding the equation of the line given the slope and one point activity number 27 finding the equation of the line given slope and the y-intercept. Activity number 28, solving real-life problems involving linear functions and pattern. Activity number 29, describing the kinds of systems of linear equation. Activity number 30, graphing systems of linear equations into variables. Activity number 31, identifying kinds of systems of linear equations in two variables according to the number of solutions. Activity number 32, identifying which system of linear equations have graphs that are parallel, intersecting, and coinciding. Activity number 33, solving systems of linear equations in two variables. Activity number 34, solving systems of linear equations in two variables. Activity number 35, solving systems of linear equations in two variables.
Activity number 36, Solving Systems of Linear Equations in Two Variables. Activity number 37, Solving Systems of Linear Equations in Two Variables. Activity number 38, Solving Geometrical Problems Involving Systems of Linear Equations. Activity number 39, Solving Numbers Relations Involving Systems of Linear Equations. Activity number 40. Solving age problems involving systems of linear equations. So this is the end of the 40 activities for the first quarter of grade 8 mathematics based on MELC or most essential learning competencies.